Financial news you can use is brought to you by University Credit Union. And welcome back to Talk 365. It is a little time for some financial news you can use brought to you by University Credit Union. And Trip, I'm going to pick your brain, okay? Please do. Okay, so we are talking mortgages all month long because University Credit Union has an incredible program right now for first time home buyers where you can get a home for 0% down and Trip will tell you why that is something you're going to need to do absolutely right away because of interest rates and a bunch of other reasons. But I was doing some little, uh, some investigative reporting and I found on the Motley Fool or fool.com, I'm not sure, something Motley like that. Fool. So um, do you know when the lowest interest rate was in recent years? 2008. 2012. The highest. How could I ever be wrong? Right. The highest. Do you know when it was its highest? Uh, 1979 under Jimmy Carter. Very 81. Okay. Close, close, close. Okay. So now this is like leading in for you. Do you realize that Jimmy Carter was president in 1981? I bet you didn't know that. I I didn't. I mean, Ronald Reagan was elected in 1980, but he, Jimmy Carter was president for the first three weeks of 1981. Oh. That is trivia that no one cares about, but I'm very proud of. We didn't. Okay, so if you pay $100 extra every month, you can shave off five years off of a loan, and that can amount into like $30,000. So that's a lot. Like if you can budget your life so you can pay off just like $100 extra a month, and I have a little story with this because a lot of lenders like do things so that you can't do it. I know Andy on his loan, he tries to do this every single month. And they tell him, sir, you've overpaid. And they try to pretend like it was an accident on his part. And he tells them, I have been doing this the entire time. So you have to like check your um, loan if you're trying to do it. Make sure that they are accepting the payment when you're doing it. Because they try to keep you into that 30-year loan. They don't want you to pay off those five years for the most part. Credit- not the University Credit Union, by the way. That is not his lender. It's Predatory credit lenders. Credit Union here, though. Yes. And there are a lot of them out there. Okay, go ahead. Okay, last one, and this is the one leading into you talking about interest rates right now, because you don't want to wait on this. Not only is it an incredible opportunity with 0% down for first-time home buyers, uh, which is a rare thing, and you want to get into a home because it's such an incredible investment, but rates are volatile. They can be volatile. So we're used to this last 10 years of it just being a nice, you know, Free slow money. ride and not anything scary happening. But as you know, early as 1994, the rates went from like 7.2 to 9.4 that year. So, I mean, huge rate fluctuation. In 87, it ranged from 9.1 to 11.4. So they can jump, they can move. So do it now. Enter you. And essentially what's happened is we have a brand new, Janet Yellen has stepped down as the Fed chairman. Mm -hmm. And because of inflation, because the economy is superheated, now is the time. Interest rates are going up. There's nothing anyone could do about it. And how fast they go up, there's no rhyme or reason, right? Well, no, there's a lot of rhyme and reason. It, but it, at it's least a for macroeconomic us to see trip. It coming, well, we don't know. There's no wa- warning, basically. Yeah, and that could mean the difference in a couple hundred dollars a month on your mortgage. So now is the time to go to University Credit Union. It is super important, and we've got something to show you. We do. With 16 locations across the Wasatch Front, it is very easy to find a University Credit Union. And Mr. Todd Summers has our financial tip of the day from University Credit Union, and he'll tell you all about one that recently got a little makeover. Check it out. Hi everybody, it's Todd from the marketing department here at University Credit Union. We're here today at our a newly renovated 5th and 5th branch. It's beautiful. You've heard of the Eiffel Tower, you've heard of the London Bridge. Now we have the 5th and 5th branch. It's, it's right up there. I would say it's probably nine or ten on the greatest list, you know, that list that I'm talking about. You've got the Sphinx. This is on that list. And if you don't believe me, come by and check it out. Fifth and Fifth, Fifth South, Fifth East, Salt Lake City. Uh, My friend Dale will be here handing out homemade cookies. And let me just say this. Let me just say this. It's better here.